Growing up, I was nowhere near being a top student. I mean, I was the worst test taker you could possibly meet. And I was never recommended for any of those advanced classes that they started putting students in around middle school. But still, this idiot who just last week misspelled the word seagull for a full minute in a scribblio game managed to graduate with two degrees, a 3.9 GPA, and get a spot in a top physics PhD program. So how did I do that? Well, that's kind of one of the things I wanna show you on this channel. To introduce myself, my name is Dario, I am 22 years old, and I am a first year physics PhD student at the University of Colorado Boulder. I did my undergraduate at the University of Buffalo, getting my degrees in both physics and electrical engineering, and I think I've done some decently cool projects up to this point. I've been competing in competitive rockergy competitions, and I've also been doing research in both academia and industry on projects ranging from theoretical physics to novel circuit designs. So why am I here, and why should you, the viewer, even care at all? Let's be real, I think me and you are both very aware that there are a lot of people on this platform already trying to do this kind of thing, but to me, it feels like every time I used to watch, it's either someone from an elite university who has cracked open the first physics textbook before the first juice box, or someone who has had access to resources and opportunities that not everybody else gets. And hey, if that's you, honestly, I'm proud of you and you deserve everything that you have. But one of my goals here is that I wanna help anyone be able to use and most importantly find the resources they need to create their own opportunities and grow in their career. I wanna be here for all of you who are already doing amazing things and for all of you who constantly feel behind. With all of you, I wanna create a community of curious minds who want to solve problems. So if you want, feel free to comment introducing yourself. Let me know what you're curious about or what kind of challenges you're currently trying to tackle. Then my biggest goal here is that I want us together to look at today's biggest research questions and what is being done to answer them. I remember when I was just starting out in research, I didn't even know what research really was. But once I kind of got into this realm, I realized just how insanely cool some of this stuff is. I mean, I can even tell you, when I was introduced to my very first research project, it was a theoretical physics project. I was sat down with the professor I was working with and he told me, okay, we are going to try to simulate this quantum circuit. And we believe that by using this quantum circuit, we can combine this simulation with neural networks and create what's called a spiking neural network, and then use this to simulate the brain. And I was blown away by how cool that was. Like what? Like we can use qu this quantum circuit to simulate the brain? Like why is no one talking about this? I haven't heard this online. I haven't heard this in classes or nothing. So that kind of makes me want to bring attention to these kinds of fascinating research problems that are currently going on and have actual conversations with so many of the people that are currently trying to answer them. So if any of this might interest you from gaining confidence to learning more about the world of research with me, feel free to subscribe and give this video a like. It would mean a lot. I promise I have plenty more to talk about, but for now I'll stop and I hope to see you in the next one.